Hello, Cruise family. Another good video for you guys. This one is in Cozumel. This is the dune buggy ride and beach break excursion that I took while I was on board the Liberty of the Seas. Uh, this excursion was probably about four, about four and a half to five hours. Uh, as soon as you get off the ship, you go through the port. They'll be waiting for you, holding up a little sign that says, you know, the name of the excursion. Uh, you follow everybody to the back of the port where they have the taxi cabs and all that. They'll have all the dune buggies lined up. Uh, they'll put you in groups if you have a small party. If you're only like two people, sometimes you can ride along with somebody else. Or you can you can request, hey, I'd, I'd like to have my own, my own dune buggy. Okay, so the dune buggy, you'll take off. You'll be riding along the coastline of Cozumel, so it's some beautiful scenery. You get to see a lot of the, the ocean. Uh, you're going to pass a couple of resorts and stuff like that, and you're going to be going to a resort. So as you, you drive, I want to say for maybe 20 minutes, you'll reach the resort. You'll park all the dune buggies all together. Uh, everybody will get out. You'll go to the resort, and it has like a, a restaurant. They have a few little small shops. They have a um, an area like with a swing. They have some uh, canopies, uh, lounge chairs where you can kind of lay out and all of that stuff. So beach is beautiful. The water is beautiful. Um, the only con, I guess you could say, is you're so isolated. It didn't feel like some of the other excursions that I took where it was just a lot more people, a lot more activities. Like sometimes they have uh, where you can do other things like parasailing, you know, stuff that you have to pay for there. This one was very isolated. There was only so many chairs. So as soon as I, I seen that there were only like 20, 20 lounge chairs or, or, or whatever, I tried to rush to try to get me one because I didn't want to be stuck with a uh, kind of like a sucky area. But uh, overall, it was nice. The drinks were included. Uh, we stayed here for about maybe two hours. Then we got back in the dune buggies, and then we drove through town or through, I guess the, you would say it's the city, of Cozumel, back to the port. All in all, the excursion was really good. I paid about $100. I think the excursion was probably about four to five hours. Overall, I would give it... I would give it an A. They were really professional. The pros was that it was affordable, uh, beautiful scenery. It created a memory that I'm probably going to remember for a very, very long time. The cons is that it's hot. Uh, some of the dune buggies did not have, like, a roof cover. There was probably, like, two or three that did, so those guys really suffered on that. There's no AC in the dune buggy, so the summertime, the heat kind of tore you up. Um, there's no music, so it was just a little bit boring, but it's okay. You can do without it. I would say if you're going to do this excursion, bring some water shoes, some sunscreen. If you have a little small Bluetooth radio, maybe you have your music saved on your phone in case you don't have Internet, bring that, and it will turn out a whole lot better if you have a little bit of music going on while you're doing the traveling. But enjoy the video. Please like and subscribe. I have some more great videos coming up for you. Thanks again for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.